What's up guys, it's Dr. Cloud here. Welcome back to the next episode of the Omega Ruby, the Pokemon Omega Ruby Nuzlocke Let's Play. And in the last episode, we went through the SSN, we rubbed an old man's back, we went through the gym and fought a war veteran. And you know what we do, we just, we beat up all those old men and war veterans, that's, that's just how we do things here in Pokemon World. But... I lost my train of thought, so we're going to do a team recap. So the MVP from the last gym, Nike, the Breloom, huge power, Mega Drain, Sky Upcut, Stun Spore, and Leech Seed. Primarina with the water availability, keeping it from being burned all day long, with Scald, Aqua Jet, Energy, Ball, and Sing. Hammer also with huge power, Sky Uppercut, Crunch, Fire Punch, and Ice Punch. Mole Man, who is not on the team, and I need to go get my actual member. Felix the Ampharos, Discharge, Thunder Wave, Power Jam, and Confuse Ray with Static. Charlie the Incineroar with Fire Fang, Crunch, Sky, Uppercut, and Swagger. Oh, that's it. Yeah, we're doing pretty good. Um, let me grab my other member out of here real quick. I don't even remember who it is right now, though. Oh, yeah, it's Pidgeot. And Pidgeot is not that good. Yeah, Pidgeot's not that good. So I'm going to grab the pseudo... We have a legendary right here. That would just be another fighting type, too. But that's just another water type. Hmm. Another grass type, another electric type, another grass or water type. He's the only one who brings something really new, but he's involved for quite a while, and Fibrava is super weak. So I feel like Pidgeot's still going to be the safest at the moment. We'll take a look at our team. Probably. Hmm. I don't know. We need, like, a decent amount more encounters, because, like, if I'm really going to, like, look at, like, remaking the squad, it'd be, like, almost a full team switch. Or would it? Breloom, I'd probably be pulling out, like, Hitmonchan and um, Pidgeot, and that's it. So, like, getting, like, a Flygon and, like, some other, like, really nice typing would probably be the direction that I go. Oh, wait, I need Mole. That's right. I have to do my cut trees. I'm glad I realized that before I actually went. Get back in there, Evergreen. Uh, by the way, Evergreen, if you guys actually care to know, uh, Evergreen has Keen Eyes ability, has Gust, Tackle, Twister, and Crunch as moveset. I have a great memory considering this thing has Arena Trap. Yep, that's what it's considering. Um, I really want to get Charlie more levels. I just hope he doesn't like die to a gravel or a golem or something. I'm getting tired. T -t -t tired. The intimidate animation is very annoying. I haven't had to deal with it too much since I'm pretty sure I changed his ability, like, not that long ago. Okay, I'm gonna go down first. I wanna see what's here. Wait, this is a new route, actually. So this would be a new encounter, I'm pretty sure. Wait, did I, did I already get an encounter here? No. I don't think so. Town here. Do I just not remember this game? Have you gathered data on at least 10 kinds of Pokemon? Yes, I have actually. Okay, which one's HM5? Flash. Okay. So I actually wasn't that far off of where Flash actually is, so I don't feel too bad. So, okay, so that's Route 2. What's this? That's also Route 2. 
Wait, I got an encounter on Route 2. Right? Yeah, I already did. That's where I got my Mareep. So it's just a different part of Route 2. Okay. So I don't actually have to worry about anything right now. Okay, yeah, yeah, I know where we are. And apparently there's more to this area again. But I can't access it until I get strength. I don't remember if there's anything that um, I really need from, like, Pewter City. Because, like, it's not like... You, you revive fossils in this game in Cinnabar. So I don't need it for that because I do have my fossil chilling right now. I feel like I'm going the wrong way now. Hold on. I feel like they messed with me. So. Right, that's Fuchsia. It's Lavender. So, oh, right, you. Right, I remember now. Yep. You needed cut to get to. Oh my goodness. Lavender Town, that's right. I remember now. This is very much a Bear With Me series, apparently. I didn't realize that's what it was going to be. I thought I knew this game a little bit better than I did, or do. But all I really need to do is look at the map, to be fair, so it wasn't like I was completely lost in the game. You know, I really do wonder what these other um, Diglets and Dugtrios have, but not to the point where I'm going to like use um, um, an ability capsule on my Diglet, because I can't imagine an ability that's going to make Diglet super viable in comparison to like a Flygon. Its its stats just aren't there to compete. Whoop. So it's just going to be another, like, set of trainers to fight, which is kind of boring, but... Huh. Do we... Do we touch the portal? I think we touch the portal. Let me just switch my lead... Okay, I'm just going to be sure, and I'm going to save before, because I don't want it to, like, crash the game. Um, okay. Spanish, Spanish, more Spanish. It's like, do you want to reach your arm in or something like that? Oh, it's a type null in Spanish. Okay. That's a cool mod. Uh, let's confuse him, see if he'll hurt himself. Let me write this guy down for another static. Thus, three encounters have all been static mon. Nice. You know, this thing definitely has the weirdest uh, Pokemon name out of anything, in my opinion. Or maybe not just in my opinion. Like, I don't feel like... I actually kind of want the, you guys to actually try. Like, what is the weirdest Pokemon name? Let's try it out. Like, I want to see what comes up in, like, comments. I'm going to speed up now, because... Oh, it snapped out of confusion. Okay. Let's try Pokeballs. Ooh. Let's throw another. We're mixing it up on him. He doesn't know what's going on. Ooh, he's in the yellow. Dang. Dang. Let's go for the great ball. Okay, now he's just like not staying in. That doesn't make any sense. 
I want to go for the Confused Ray, but I know he's going to hit himself too many times. Nice. Hey, I guess it doesn't matter, since we're going to nickname him anyways what his original name was. Uh, I'm going to name him Keith. Reminds me, or it doesn't remind me, I was just thinking about um, the Keith crew on uh, YouTube. I, it's a funny show. If you guys don't know what it is, you guys should definitely check it out. It like does um, he does like Smash Bro kind of like um, pa parody videos. I don't know how to exactly word it, but they're fun to watch. I enjoy them. Actually, let me check out Type Null. I'm pretty sure so Valley can only have one ability, so. It doesn't really matter exactly what ability he has. I mean, it's like, you know, he's he's okay. He'd be a pretty solid normal type. Unless I'm going to get, you know, slacking without True on or Reggie Gigas. But I do have one legendary right now, and that's pretty cool. You know, I just realized I could have um, gone back to Pallet Town. And they changed this route a lot. And I could have uh, gotten the uh, fishing counter there. But it's no big deal. We'll do it another time. Maybe, probably not. Maybe if we can fly. It's a very interesting trainer. Ooh, I'm gonna say no. I really don't enjoy confusion. That's kind of scary. And it's still alive. Um, is Fire Fang 100% accurate? It's 95. I feel like Crunch is basically going to be the same. Well, not it's not quite, but I think it's going to be enough. Yep. And a Bell Awesome. And I missed. See, there's that 95% accuracy coming in. Come on. Thank you. Alright. Um, I don't really want to deal with paralysis the entire time, and I don't want to waste potions, so we're going to go back and heal. You know, I feel like now that I'm thinking about that, that little gate thing that I can jump over it used to be like a little um, ledge. Because I feel like I used to do that whenever I was playing through these games I used to jump over something like all the time like that oh wait air slash is special I mean it's still a good move I just really need a physical flying type move for Pidgeot but I mean air um Diglett can learn air slash Okay. Sure, why not? Okay, Machop, we got that in the bag. He just about killed himself. I guess we are weak to fighting. Let's go for the... Yeah, let's go for this Kyrie cut. Okay. I'm gonna end up killing myself. That's this right. Man, it's crazy how much higher Breloom's attack is. I am sealed in here now. Um, so we're going to give Hammer a little bit of a chance. I know this is a new route, so I'm going to wait to see about catching if I can. I'm going to battle this guy. Let's get the Fire Punch. Gone. Hit it again. I forget what Rage Powder even does, but it doesn't matter, apparently. Okay. I'm just trying to knock out these trainers. Let's get the Fire Punch. Nice. Oh, is this another trainer with a Vika Volt? Nope. Heracross. I 
do not know what he just hit me with. I maybe it was like retaliate the um move that like after one of your uh Hey, Sophie, stop. One second guys. I'm working on training with her. Um, I'll spray a water bottle. And most of the time I don't even have to spray it because she just knows that if I grab that then she's doing something wrong. Right, Soph? Good girl. I think we only sprayed her like once or twice with the actual water bottle and then she just figured it out that she did not like being sprayed. I'm a little bit worried about this, so I'm gonna go ahead and take a turn to heal. Oh, it has Dragon Rage. And it's just gonna spam Dragon Rage, apparently. I can see that being good. I know I got rid of priority right there, but I feel like it's going to be a good thing. Wow. I cannot believe it lived on that. Okay, my whole team's getting, like, really low here. Um, let me throw Ampharos out front for right now. That guy's not even going to get me anywhere. I don't even know why I'd go that direction. So I might run into an encounter here. Ooh. A very underleveled Scrafty. I also don't know what route number this is right now, but it's fine. We're going to catch him. Okay. Like I said, we're going to catch him. There we go. Scrafty. I'm gonna call you Jerry. His uh, pants remind me, um, ooh, what a love to Grimer. Reminds me of the episode of um, Rick and Morty where uh, the galactic government's falling apart and everyone thinks that pants are what you need to um, run the universe. And if you haven't seen Rick, or Rick and Morty, and don't understand what I'm talking about, then this is going to sound even weirder. But uh, Jerry's just crawling on the ground, trying to run from everyone. And that's just what I, what I was thinking of. He has Intimidate. Nice. Low kick, faint attack. Not bad. But yeah. That's just what made me think about. No. Actually, I can check. Um, let me just check uh, Jerry here, where I caught him. Route nine. Too fast. Yep. I have so much to talk about right now. I'm not tired at all, I swear. Sorry about the burps. I just have a lot of gas build up for reasons, I guess. Probably mainly because, you know, I have a Mountain Dew, like, right there next to me. It's probably a pretty good and obvious reason for why that may be happening. Okay, that guy just didn't notice me, so I'm actually guessing that he is a, um... He's the guy who gives me a static, I'm guessing. Is he giving me a Ralts right now? Oh. Boy, oh boy. Hey, Daisy. One of my cats is a crier. She'll... Cry like right at my door to be um, let out, and then if I close the door, she'll want right back in. So it's just better. Yep, here she is. To just keep her inside the room, so that she doesn't cause trouble. She is very much a troublemaker. 
like that um oh that song by um I mean who's by it's like it's like a, it's like a trouble maker trouble maker I'm a bad singer deal with it uh let's go for Marina yep one for submission let's see how much hyper voice does pretty good thanks like gold still would have done more though uh you're you're gone Ooh, a Machamp? Let's see if we can get that burn. I'm gonna heal, because I did not see how much that did. Okay, he missed. Okay, we're good. Okay. Daisy. Like I said, big whiner. All the time. If she's not getting attention, whine. It's just what it is. It's pretty much what I signed myself up for whenever I decided to get animals. And um, she was the last one added to the bunch. Even after the dog, like, um, it was definitely more of like a she found us kind of situation. Because, like, um, she was definitely a lost, like, um, kitten at the time. And, um, she was basically, uh, given to us. And, uh, she was gonna be taken to the shelter, but then on, like, right when we brought her home, I was working on some homework at my desk, and she decided that, um, she did not want to, um, cuddle with my girlfriend at the time. My, my current girlfriend still, I don't know why I said it like that. Um, she wanted to lay with me. So, she comes over and just sleeps on my lap. And that's going to kill me if it hits me again. So, she very quickly integrated herself into the family. By just falling asleep right on me. And... It was more of like we did not have a choice at that point because she had bonded to me. I think she's playing with another cat outside the door. I would have left Darumaka too. I feel like the Grimer would have been really nice because of coverage. You know, just having a different typing. So if you guys haven't figured this out already, I'm a very big animal person. Like, I, I will definitely say that... Um, I am more of a cat person because I think mainly because of the type of dog that I do have because she requires a lot of energy I'm gonna say to keep up with and my energy is already spread fairly thin so it's hard that's oh, weekend what's up bro it's hard a lot of days to go through and have her energy levels. Oh, nice. Norcorio. I'm going to forfeit this encounter if it's a new place, but I don't think it is. Nope, it is. So I just forfeited that encounter, but that's not a big deal. Like, Oracorio is a nice mod and all, but I doubt I'm going to use an Oracorio right now. Especially whenever I have a tep pig in waiting too. Um, but yeah, definitely a very big animal person. Um, and that really only came up a few years ago. What did that guy say? Oh, I mean, it gets you money. Nope. So I only have 11 kinds of Pokemon. That sucks. Uh, wait, I just got a new mon. I got the Ralts. Let me see what's going on with it. Hey, Sophie? No, no. Stay down. It's okay. Stop. Stop. She's a very licky dog. And like I said, she requires a lot of um, energy to keep up with. And that's just not always something that I do have. And sometimes I do feel bad. And this is literally exactly like Serge's right shoe. 
so I should just be able to crunch it. Yep. I did not see what was coming out next, and I'm, I feel like it said Clefable, and I really don't have anything for Clefable. Sky Uppercut it is. Oh my goodness, is this thing a pure fairy? I didn't think it was. Um, now for safety purposes, we're gonna switch out and hit that thunder wave. So at least maybe a little bit, it won't just be able to set up on me. Okay, I'm gonna take the hits right now because it can't really do a lot. Okay, we're still landing, so that's good. Okay. Nice. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see that. Um, she's just chilling on the pillows, and that's what she does at night, too, is she just lays down on my pillows, and I get maybe part of a pillow. But that's pretty much what I signed on for with her. And honestly, like, if I really wanted it to change, then I could do that. But, like, um, I, I just kind of like the way she is, you know? Uh, I'm going to go ahead and write in the Oricorio encounter that I missed that. And we're just going to make this a little, a little bit shorter of an episode. And we'll just get through Rock Tunnel in the next one. So let me just real quickly grab out Pidgeot. Nope, Pidgeot. Um, also, another thing I'm kind of thinking about now. The So that girl had uh, Mons that were, I think she maxed out at 43. I have two 40s right now. I probably should do some grinding. I don't know. I mean, I'm going to go through Rock Tunnel, and that's like a pretty scary place, in my opinion. Because there's quite a number of trainers there, and I'm probably not going to have Flash. Alright. Uh, and they probably changed it too because they've changed like pretty much every cave in this place or in this game. So I'll think about it, but for now, um, I'm just going to witness them. So if you guys enjoyed um, and want to support me, you can subscribe. And if you want to see when this episode go up, go up um, I will always be posting them on Twitter, whether it's that day or like right whenever they go up. I will definitely let you guys know. Um, so if you enjoyed, uh, leave a like, subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.